What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Star Wars Battlefront. We return after a brief hiatus here in the Graveyard of Giants playing some Walker Assault and talking about our favorite character from Episode 7. The movie has now been out for quite a while. Han Solo has been, well... <laughs> the movie has been out for quite a while, uh, and uh, so I've had time to think about what I liked, didn't like, who I liked, didn't like, and I think I've determined my favorite character. Now, I went in thinking my favorite character, by the way, let me know who your favorite character is in the comments below, um, if you know or if you have an idea uh, of who your favorite is and why, I think that'd be cool, oh my god, they killed me. Uh, I went in thinking it would be Ray, and I'm actually going to switch hands to this new one that has a scan pulse that I have assembled here, because then I can scan for trouble, all these hooligans trying to ruin my day. Anyhow, I went in thinking to be Rey, main lead, you know, for the, the heroes, good girl, strong, powerful, cool character, kind of a, a change of pace for Star Wars, even though some people would say that Leia was such a strong heroine, you know, I just felt like Rey actually had, like, a lot of, like, coolness to her, uh, that I was gonna really enjoy, like, uh, have a good time with. And I did, I think she's a really fun character, but there were bits of pieces of, of her storyline uh, that I wish were different. I wish they had fleshed more about her backstory. I thought that was interesting and would be intriguing, and I know they're saving it for a later later time. That's fine. Uh, I wish that she wasn't instantly so strong with the Force. I'm guessing they, they did that just to set up that, oh, she really is the focal point of the series and has, you know, clearly a very uh, notable past. But I just didn't like the fact that they, like, you know, I don't know. Holy crap. What is it with killing me three times in a row? Third time's the charm. I guess after three deaths, now we're ready to go. Uh, anyhow, I just wish that she would have had more of a, of a slower arc. Um, also, I, well, try not to say anything about spoilers. Anyhow, I, I just wish that she wasn't as proficient, let's say, as she ended up being. But what, what really struck me was that Kylo Ren, uh, despite a lot of people's qualms about him, worry about him, fear that he'd end up being dumb, and, and even after watching the movie that thought that he ended up dumb, I really liked him, and I thought that he uh, made for an incredibly interesting villain because he was so sporadic. He wasn't reliable in sort of a good or bad way, uh, and he challenged the traditional, hey, I'm an old evil guy with a big sword and a, you know, a big evil laugh uh, vibe that we've got from Star Wars in the past, uh, or a, a big evil face in the case of Darth Maul who didn't say anything. Uh, I like the fact that he threw tantrums. I like the fact that he was really, you know, unreliable and would make mistakes and do things that, you know, didn't didn't seem like a good villain thing to do. That he wasn't perfect, that he wasn't, you know, always on his A-game, that he has weaknesses, flaws, and that I could see him uh, easily having a storyline that veers one of many directions. He could become good, he could become stay evil, he could do a whole lot of things, but hopefully... All of them are, are not what we'd expect, so I think that was kind of the coolest part of him, was that you really didn't know what was coming next from Kylo Ren. Uh, and, and sure, there was definitely some telegraphing and whatnot, and I think the, the overall opinion is that eventually he will turn good, and I think they could do that right as long as they build up enough emotional cash by having him do a lot of really bad things first. We need to make sure that they really establish why this guy uh, is important and why him turning good would be a big deal before they just turn him good, you know what I mean? Like, don't just turn him good because it's, it's it's a cute thing to do, and I hope they really don't just try and hit every plot point that 4, 5, and 6 hit. Anyhow, Kylo Ren has a great costume. That right there makes him amazing. Um, and I know some people didn't like Adam Driver's voice, they didn't like Adam Driver's face, they took, they took issue with quite a few things that he was and wasn't, but I, I really liked a lot of those flaws, and I thought it made for a more interesting character. I love his lightsaber. I love the fact that his lightsaber, uh, like, the way that it was built, if you guys haven't, like, read about that, the reason, um, you know, the, the, what do you call it, like, the, uh, gosh, what's the word I'm looking for? The crystal is not contained properly, it, it's very, um, volatile, and so, uh, it needs the cross vents to, to get rid of excess, like, uh, basically ventilation, and then it also, uh, has sort of the wavering electricity, uh, to symbolize that volatility, and that kind of symbolizes Kylo Ren as a whole, which I think is a is a cool idea and a cool concept. Now, we are not shutting down these links so well, but we are moving the AT-ATs. Uh, number two is dying. 
and Skywalker's been located, so this is this is good because it took it took them a whole movie to find him, and, and my probe droid found him in like five seconds. So raise for everybody in the droid division, guys and girls. Raise for everybody in the droid division. Um, hello, weird head. That guy had a pointy head. Not anymore. Now he's dead. Uh, anyhow, let me know in the comments below who your favorite Episode Seven character was. I'm curious to hear what the general consensus is. I'm thinking it's going to be Kylo or Rey. I'd be surprised if anyone said their favorite was Finn, although I know there are some Finn fans out there. Uh, part of the FFF Finn Fan Fan Club. A lot of people up on top of the down walker, which is cool. Um, I still am just grieving over the fact that they uh, are not putting any Episode 7 content into this game. I know it's because they want to sell us more Episode 7 stuff later and whatnot, but man, wouldn't it have been nice? Throw that squad shield down. I thought it was a thermal imploder, so that's good news. And I'm meleeed to death. One shot melee, really? It's a strong punch. Perhaps it's because he had a RPG in hand. All right, we got to do some damage here. Let's let's team up with. Uh... Yeah, I was gonna team up with that guy to shut that one down, but apparently, not part of the plan. Rebel scum being ridiculous as always. Okay, how come my big old blast from the past with the RPG smash did not kill him, but his did? So rude. After not playing this game for a while, there's a couple things that you come back and you're like, man, sometimes the deaths aren't fun when you're getting shot across the map. And I know I've used that to my advantage, but it would be nice if the lasers didn't have a million feet range. And I don't really like the coin system. But alas, I freaking really like this game. And I think it's pretty darn fun. Hey Luke, I'm trying to kill you here, so if you could just stand still, that would probably be a good idea. No? Okay. Well, I tried to give you a grenade. Gotcha! Comeback bonus, because I'm coming back. Coming back for this guy, coming back for that guy. Shooting him, getting the assist. Don't climb up there, I'm going to miss. And I did. There we go, and that was an assist apparently. There's a guy coming. There's a, oh. Hello? Hello? It's Lucas! Lucas Stump! Struck a grenade at Lucas Stump. I wounded the hero though, which is good news. And Vader is here, and he'll be happy that I did what I did. Is Skywalker down yet? Hey! 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 Okay, okay, okay. Getting killed by that guy. Way over there. Luckily, I've got a partner to bring it back. Uh, my second favorite character was Rey, as I kind of established. My third, though, may surprise you. Uh, my third favorite character, we talked about Finn, talked about Kylo, talked about Rey. My third favorite character was BB-8. Uh, I guess that's not really a surprise. <laughs> I feel like it's pretty obvious who people like in the movie. Maybe people don't. I know a lot of people did like Poe. I wasn't really a big Poe fan, I'm not really sure what about him didn't didn't really lure me in. I'm not a big fan of any of the returning characters. I, I preferred seeing the new guys. Um, I like the fact that I wanted even more focus, but I like the fact that they kept most of the focus on the new guys. Um, my least favorite bits were the ones where it felt nostalgic, and I know that that comes off as like blasphemous and, and insane, but I'm just being honest with you. I wanted it to start as fresh as can be, and I like the fact that it for the most part, seem to do that. Um, and I like that they didn't rely entirely, you know, on old news. You know what I mean? Anyhow. I can tell you my least favorite character, but I, that would really upset some people, so I'm not going to do that. Alright? I'm not going to do that. Almost an insane streak, but I did let two people spawn on me, so hey, 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 it's a great day, and one of my walkers is almost dead. That is not good. So we're going to have, uh, like, a, a half of a walker to survive one last uplink. We really should probably go shut these things down, and I'm about to get hit with an orbital strike. That guy is dead. Okay. Um, can we go shut this down? What do you think, team? Maybe moving towards the objective would be nice. I'll pulse. I wish the pulse could be seen by my whole team. That would be really cool. Is this a hero token? No, I'm guessing not. That's a... Okay, well... Here we go. Get in the big guns. 
Hello, dude on the hill. You're dead. Can't see behind there. That's smart, so you can't just like shoot from way far away. Good map design. Hey. Hey. There's Luke. Okay, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not really a good. Uh, not really a good cannon man. I think I'm better at going to shut down the links. Paul. Oh, lots of guys over there. Surprise, surprise. Don't shoot me. Shoot my friends. What the heck? Come on. Do I have to lead these guys? Sometimes I feel like I have to lead. Sometimes I feel like I don't have to lead. I don't know. It's weird. I bounced a grenade off his body. That's why I should have used impact. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. All right. Hold that up link, guys. Come on. Shut it down. It's got a little bit more to go, and they grabbed it. Great. Ah, I tell you. I need to recruit all new rebel soldiers. I mean, all new empire. All new scumbags, scuttlebutt soldiers from my group here. Gotcha, you dingus. I really like getting the headshots. It feels nice. Thanks for stealing my coin. I was going for that. I wonder what the time spent going for coins that you don't get is. Probably a lot. I, I spend a lot of time going for coins I don't get. Gotcha with the headshot. Alright, bucko. There are, oh, look at that. That was a lucky bounce. It was a good bounce. And was that a guy or was that a cannon? I couldn't tell. Either way, I'm dead but from the, a gang in LA. I gotta be careful when I move there that that doesn't happen. Alright, so that one is now locked in again. They now have five Y wings compared to our half walker. Not a, not a really good proposition. Seems like though we're bombing in well here. And I am hoping that the first DLC pack is soon. I think we're ready and ripe for it. Indeed. Okay, I shot that. There we go. Thank you. I was going to say, I got a couple hits on him. Run for the hills. Shut down. You're going to shut this down. There we go. Keep the uplings offline. Blow guys up. That's real fine. I'm going to send a pulse, okay? Yeah. Gotcha. Trait level two. So I think these trait things are upgraded throughout the, the match individually, not throughout the, uh, as far as I'm aware, not not permanent. It's not a permanent upgrade. Correct? Am I correct in, in saying that? Do I have the correct verbiage? That's a good guy. I mean a bad guy, but in my case, it's a good guy. You know how I feel about bad guys. They're good guys to me. Whoa. Okay, good. Thanks for getting my back. Who is shooting? Got to keep this thing offline. It's my job. They trusted me with it. Okay. Paulson. Gary Paulson. That, he, he, wrote, he, wrote, he wrote kids books. I think he wrote The Hatchet. I think that's Gary Paulson. Is that a different Gary? You guys tell me in the comments below if you know about Gary. Uh, we're, we're walking and both of them are now offline. Lots of evil empire jerks over there. This is good news. I've got a thermal imploder. I could be in the AT. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Thank you. The first. Darth Vader, you should, okay. Hello. Chucking that thing. And I didn't even grab the, the token. Awesome. Really now? Hey, it's Greedo! I never liked you, Greedo! Actually, I really like Greedo. I got my dog, Greedo dog toy, because I like, like the look of Greedo. I think Greedo has a good look. I think he's got a nice look. If I was a, an alien woman, I would probably date Greedo. Is that weird? I should not say that. Sorry. I really like this scan pulse thing. I think it comes in massive handy when it lets you know who's around, where your friends are, who your partner is, when guys fall to their knees and die because you hate them. And I think we're about to win. As long as we can defend the walker here a little bit longer. Buntar Walker, whatever he said. Yeah, I agree. Gotcha. All the kills and the assists. Kill me if you may, Orson Matt. I'll walk all over you. Like a doorman. Anyhow. Defeat. What? We were just about to win. Wow. My squad. Me and BH7NY623. Pulling all the work over here. Don't think anyone else thought it was important to defend the rebels. 
Well, actually, a lot of people did because they won. To defend the... Em I, I, see, saying the Empire feels weird now that there's the First Order and the Empire isn't really a thing. Anyhow. I love you guys super much. Let me know who your favorite character is in the comments down below. Hopefully we can play new Battlefront maps soon. Hopefully they're coming. And uh, until next time, guys and girls, I love you so much. Have a fantastic day. Let me know your favorite character in the comments down below. And we will see you all later.